As long as we just do the regular maintenance, we're, we're fine. The gutters are always clean and, uh, and it's fine. Other than peeling paint, we don't have any threats of, uh, of cracking, further cracking. We've stayed on top of the roof breaches. So without the water breach, uh, it's in great shape and it's well constructed. The exterior will definitely be preserved. So all the f exterior facades and any molding that, uh, there is some significant uh, damage on some of the moldings. So we will be uh, uh, constructing that in the same manner in which it was intended. Our use variance allows it to be used as office space. So uh, some of the likely tenants would be um, and the few that we've talked to, and there has been a lot of activity recently, have been um, financial advisory firms, law firms, trust companies, and I think that's probably the most likely end user for the property. It's the last remaining walled estate in the city of Wilmington, and it has deep, deep history. It was uh, originally owned by Brinkle who was the grandnephew of Caesar Rodney. And then uh, Isabella DuPont Sharp and Hugh Rodney Sharp acquired it, and then they added on substantially, and they had this uh, wonderful architect do the gardens, the Marion Coffin. With that deep history, it's, uh, we're proud to be a part of it.